Dallas police have arrested a 22-year-old man for the shooting death of his 16-year-old girlfriend. Arturo Flores is now in the Dallas County Jail charged with murder. The body of Venus Rodriguez was found Monday in a creek. Fox 4's Davidson Tendry reports. A red cross in Oak Cliff reads the name Venus Rodriguez. A few feet away, yellow crime scene tape is a bitter reminder of the 16-year-old girl's body being found in a creek off Brookhaven Drive Monday morning. Dallas police say Rodriguez died from multiple gunshot wounds. Now her boyfriend, 22-year-old Arturo Flores, is charged with her murder. How could you be so sick in the head to, like, just kill someone and just throw them in the creek like they're nothing. Like, she had a whole life ahead of her. Rodriguez's cousin, Angelina Hernandez, says she was her best friend. Many in their family have yet to grasp the loss. They say the pain is magnified because Rodriguez left her family last year. She started hanging around the wrong people in the wrong crowd. She ran away. A Dallas police detective confirms to Fox 4 that Rodriguez was reported as a runaway. Family says she left in September. They believed she was with Flores, her boyfriend. You know, we told the police where she was at or who she was with, and they just said, okay, that they were working on it, they were working on it, and they'll get back to us, they'll get back to us, and it just seems like they never did. And, you know, now it's too late. Rodriguez's family did not believe Flores was a positive influence. He poisoned her mind. He poisoned her head. He, like, put a spill on her or something, and she believed it. They worried for her safety. We loved her dearly. Still, they never suspected her boyfriend would be charged with her murder. Why did he take her away from us? You know, she's not going to be able to live her life and have a life anymore. At this time, Dallas police have not released details of what led them to arrest Flores. For now, the teenager's family hopes the 22-year-old's arrest leads to a conviction. I want to see him suffer for what he did. You know, she was my best friend, and like, we're never going to see her grow up. David Centendry, Fox 4 News.